द कामेंट्स रिक्वेड फॉर दिस एक्सपेरिमेंट आर ESP32 बोर्ड सिंगल चैनल रिले सॉलनाइट लॉक थ्री बैटरीज एंड ए बैटरी होल्डर कनेक्टिंग वायर्स एंड कनेक्टिंग केबल Now log into the thingesp.sidesh.me website and here create an account. If you already have an account, click this login button, enter the username and password and click login. Now go to this your projects uh, tiles. Here click add new project. Here we can give the project name. I am giving the project name as IoT project. and give the project's device credentials. Now click the submit button. Now the project is added successfully, click OK. Now go to Twilio.com website and create an account. If you already have an account, go to login. Here under the email address, click continue. Then we need to enter the password and click the continue button. Now click this Twilio home button and here create a new account. Click create new account. Here we can give an account name. I am giving the name as WhatsApp API. Here select Twilio and click continue. Here I am selecting the billing country as India and click on the create new account button. Now here we need to select what do you plan to build with Twilio. So here select other and then which Twilio product are, are you here to use? Select WhatsApp. And here we can select hobbyist or student. And how do you want to build with Twilio? Here we select with no code at all. Here select something else. And click get started with Twilio. Now from the left side menu, click messaging. Here you can see a menu, try it out, click that and then click on send a whatsapp message so here select this checkbox and click confirm now go to sandbox settings so here we created a project in thing esp website so here we got an endpoint url copy this url and paste here and click on the save button now go to the sandbox tab here you got a contact number you need to save this number in your uh, mobile phone and then go to whatsapp search for this contact and then you need to send this message join beer hyphen satellites in that uh, chat window then after that we need to enter the uh, text to get the output. Let's see how to do that. Now, this is our program. So here we need to enter the so the, uh, username, project name and the device credentials. So our username is TechTrends. So here TechTrends. So our project name is IoT project. Copy this and paste here. And the device credentials also I gave tech trends. Then we need to enter the Wi-Fi username and password. Now we need to upload the program. 
For that, connect your ESP32 board to your laptop. Go to this drop down. You can see the port is selected. Click on that and search for the ESP32 board. So the model is ESP32 Dev module. Select that. Click OK. Now click this upload button and upload the program. Now the program is successfully uploaded to the ESP32 board. Now we can check the output.